and welcome back to R and Y Inside Learning Hub. I am Sumit Kumar Chaudhary, and you are watching the Java series. In our last video, we have learned how to create an Excel file and write data into it using the Apache Py library. As you can see, okay. Today we are going to take it a step further and uh, learn how to read a data from an Excel file using the same library. As of now, we show the data uh, in Excel file directly. Now we are going to print in console. So if you have not watched uh, our previous video, be sure to check them out for complete understanding of uh, working with Excel file in Java. So let's get started. Now uh, I am going to create a class read Excel data Apache Py. Okay. So, for read a uh, Excel file, uh, first we need to fetch the Excel file. For fetch the Excel file, uh, I am using a file input stream which is under the java.io library. Now I am going to create a object. I will provide a path of the file. So file input stream uh, throw an exception. For now, I am adding an exception. You can handle an exception using a try catch. We have covered uh, how we can handle an exception, uh, how many type of exception in a previous video. If you have not watched, then please watch our previous video. I will mention the link in the description okay so now we have a workbook method under the apache file library to get a workbook get workbook so now i am calling this class and provide a file path so this will throw an exception. So I am adding an exception for now. And now we need to fetch a sheet from the Excel file to read our data. So for do that, we have a sheet a interface. And now I am going to create a object, get workbook and get sheet. So we have so many methods as you can see, we have so many methods, we will discuss one by one in a coming video for, so I am going to get a sheet. So you can get a sheet by the name, if you know about the sheet name, if not, then you can use the index number, okay. Now I am going with index number. So our seat index is 0, now check, yeah, so this is a 0 index, now I am going to close, okay. Now we have not aware how many row and how many columns, so for deal this, we using our loop, so for better, we using a for each loop, so first we get a row. Get a row and sheet from the sheet. And uh, now I am going to get a sheet and uh, now get a cell. Now cell get get cell type.
okay so uh, we have not aware uh, how how type of the data is in excel uh, string numeric or special character so for handle this i am uh, going with the switch case get cell type will help to get a cell type okay okay now case will handle the cases get cell data get string cell value okay now use break to exit from the loop now i am going to copy this part and numeric now i am going to numeric value okay for print new line i am using a system dot out dot print ln now run the file one second oh sorry we have not provided a file path uh now right click on a file and uh, copy the file path and click the root path okay now run this file <coughs> now successfully we get the data but this is not organized way okay now i am i will organize so we have a format option so for do that uh, we can use print f for formatting now i will format so this will apply a gap okay and now for string and for numeric okay now second now this will i will apply in a here so we will get well organized data in our console so we can read the data easily okay now run the java code so you can see we get our data uh, well organized uh, now i will show the excel file to confirm we have get our right data so as you can see we get all the data okay now we successfully read the data uh, from the file 
if you found this uh, video helpful for you uh, don't forget to like share and uh, uh, your suggestion in the comment section uh, please don't forget to subscribe our channel to get a more insightful programming tutorial see you next time thanks guys